Hey guys, happy Valentine's Day. Today, we're gonna to be reacting to another performance at the San Remo 2024 event. This time is to Angelina Mango, and she is performing La Noia. Let's go. So full disclosure guys, we have heard the song, but by mistake when we reacted to it, we reacted to like, it was like a show after or something like that. Mm -hmm. So it wasn't like the full performance from the San Remo. Mm -hmm. So we wanted to go back to this and watch this see because people said that, oh, they were tired and etc. So this, this mm -hmm. is better. So that's, we're going to watch all four of the performances, one through four for, from uh, like the Tuesday or Wednesday nights whenever they performed. Because uh, all of those one through four we watched from like uh, after the show mm -hmm. already. The song is good, man. I, for, I forgot, like, because you know, we did so many and we, mm -hmm. we watched them. Oh, this is good, this is good, this could have won. I, I see why she won. Mm -hmm. This is pretty good. And I, I like her, uh, she shows a little personality, yes. like a little uh, body movement, yeah. it's, it's a little different, it's, it's entertaining. Mm -hmm. And the dress she's wearing is not black, so that's interesting. It's black, it's some nude illusion. Yeah, but it's not black, it's colors. Like the green stripe mm -hmm. or something. Yeah, she deserved to. So mm -hmm. Like, well, okay, we'll, I guess. You have to see. You should have started first. with fourth, with Gali and go You think up. so? Yeah. Could have watched her last. I think mm. we should have done that. Mm, okay. We watch it as they perform. I mean, if you were a judge, you should still like have uh, your opinion. Right, right, right. No, but she she has the stage mm -hmm. presence. Yeah, so, she's like, commanding the stage. Yeah, compared to like some of the others we watch, we're like, oh, it's a good song. It could, yeah, but the stage presence wasn't like hers. Like she she's commanding the stage. I do enjoy her performance, her presentation overall. I feel like you know it is a different, a little bit different energy from performing this time as opposed to what we see. It's after. very, very different. Yeah, very energy. different. Yeah, because after she like, you could tell she was like. She just sang the song. She mm -hmm. didn't perform it, she sang mm -hmm. it. Now, this is our whole performance. Mm. Yeah, like her intonation with her voice is mm -hmm. this very... Uh, what's the word? Uh, Wait, like that she's animated mm -hmm. there you go she's very animated with her voice definitely very passionate in her performance i can see like you know her heart put on the main stage like this and I do enjoy the instrumentals of this one. This definitely sounds nice, even replay it again after. And as I've been saying throughout the reactions, I, f I feel like she was able, her song, this song can capture a vast, Mm. A selection of people. The young people can vibe to it. You know, the older people can vibe mm -hmm. to it. 
it's not a particular genre like it it's like a, i don't even know about it's a pop genre i guess it's mm -hmm. pop but it gives that little classic flair i yeah. guess with the instruments that's true that's so it capture maybe a little older generation or not necessarily older but the the music purists, I mm -hmm. guess, who like that, the uh -huh. instrumentals, yeah. not more so like the popness of it. So uh, I feel like, yeah, this song can capture a lot of people. Because uh, as we're going to see, the Giolier, Gali, Annalise, mm -hmm. I feel like they're more like pop pop songs for, for the younger generation. Mm -hmm. So well, we'll see. <laughs> Very entertaining performance. Mm -hmm. I, I'm entertained watching this because yesterday we watched her performance. It was pretty boring. This is, uh, uh -huh. I mean, it was. I said I would have flipped the channel, <laughs> but this this is entertaining. <laughs> composition here is cutthroat. I imagine they have to perform, practice, do this multiple times. Yeah. It's a lot of effort, a lot of energy. And she, she's a star. Like you can see she has a star quality about mm -hmm. her. Like she has that quality. She's really putting out her vocals out there. Everyone's like just staring in awe at her. It's amazing. So I think Lanoia means bored because I have the lyrics put, mm -hmm. put it up. I'm, I'm, I'm trying to read it little by little as we go. But I, I think what she's saying, uh, she's uh, that, that Lanoia, when she keeps repeating it, it means bored. Mm -hmm. She does not sound bored. I think what she's singing is like the music makes life not boring. I think that's mm. that's the gist of it. Mm. Uh, I like that you know there's different levels into the song. There's highs. It's like it's not. It, there's no plateau. There's yes. not like a wait for a exactly. build or anything like that. She gets right into yeah. it. That was my criticism of some of the lower play mm -hmm. songs that were kind of like I, it was so boring that mm -hmm. by the time we got to the build up I was already mm -hmm. turned off. Yeah. Good, this was good. Bravo! This was Angelina Mango performing La Noia. Of course, we have reacted to this previously, but this was after she uh, was told the results so of course comparing the two performances this is by far very entertaining so we are and we will be going back to uh first second third fourth and fifth, yeah, fourth. no fifth we, fourth? fifth we did already fifth we already did because i think Arama was fifth and Arama we did yesterday mm. so we're going to review second third and fourth um from the San Remo 2024 event so stay tuned don't forget to like comment and subscribe join the gang and as always 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 share as much kindness as possible Bye.